expectations are the biggest problem in VR is that VR is often just not where these studios are just not putting out the type of content that we see in flat games like as far as like amount of content it doesn't have the maps the mode the guns it's just a smaller audience it's smaller budgets and so expectations are a tough thing but go back to Solaris though when it launched on PC and Quest I remember just sitting there doing my review going so this is a multi PvP multiplayer shooter that is going to live or die on its team dynamic because that's how Firewall was so good too you'd get in with four, four players you'd be taking on another four players and you'd just be having a ton of fun with each other as you were kind of like okay I'm on point A da 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 da, da you know and it didn't have online matchmaking like it didn't have sorry it didn't have team uh, the ability to form teams you like you literally could not play with your friends unless it was by luck luck yeah what the fuck like look, they look they hid behind i mean it was a release but they it was a pre-season release right that was their big um their, their, their little word over that which is basically to me early access so i do agree they shouldn't have released it they should release it in early access because then you then you wouldn't you could forgive it for not having those things yet because they're basically like nope this is our game but it's pre season ahead of whatever the heck they you know added after the fact which wasn't very much um, I think that was also a big misstep them kind of like saying our game is out but not really but kind of and so it's like well is it that out? was unforgivable though I no, like of, of anything that you were gonna not put in there. Like, that's fucked. Now you can't play with your friends. Like, why even bother even coming out the door then? Yeah, like, a team-based shooter where you can't play with your friends, yeah. You only <laughs> get one shot.